Oh, he countered the spell for everybody, not just yeah. him. Yeah, yeah, I stopped so, her spell. The spell affected everybody. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. What? I worked so hard to get these guys out here. Why would you do this to me? To me specifically. Silence. Friends, Elder Dragon Hijinx is sponsored by Architect.com. The devs behind it are in the same team that bought you EDH Rec, and they built an incredibly cool site to store all your commander decks, keep track of your collection, and playtest your newest brews. One of my favorite things about Architect is being able to grab the correct printing of your cards from Scryfall and drop it directly into your deck list. How cool is that? So if that sounds good to you, go check out Architect.com. What What do you all usually prefer as like a uh like you're starting like seven teach me some evil strats so um, ramp uh, is usually a good thing that ramp is basically what lets you do things faster than what turn it is and learning. again we're if we use buzzwords and you don't know what they mean please just shout yeah we'll absolutely simplify. call us that we're very deep in the lingo unfortunately yeah. we live I'm good with I'm good with context stuff. clues, so I'll I, I should be able to follow along. You're smart. We're in that You'll situation get it. where we do this so much we don't know how much we know, and yeah. it can be like kind yeah, of yeah the weird uh, the professor's it. dilemma, right? I've been teaching this too long at a high level. I can't teach entry level mathematics. If at any point you want to <laughs> like show us a hand and be like, what the hell do I do here? Please go for it. If you have yeah. any questions, just ask. Okay. Um, We'll start, we, we normally do like the intro outro thingy uh, after the game, but because we're live and we're in front of your audiences, hello everyone, uh, we'll just go around and introduce who we are and uh, what we're playing today. So that's basically what we do in the beginning of the show. So I'll start. Uh, hi, I'm Ailey. Um, I am playing Bilbo, birthday celebrant. It is the alternative commander for the Lord of the Rings pre-con. He cares about life gain. If he gets to 111 life, bad things happen. So. Uh, well, if I get to 111 life, bad things happen. So yeah, keep me in check, I guess. If you need something to hit, I'm a good option for it. Olivia. I'm Olivia. Um, I am on Elder Dragon Hijinks. I have another show on YouTube called Commander at Home with Ryan Kibler, who is apparently a good magic player. Uh, not that he isn't. I just didn't know that until we met. Anyway, <laughs> I do that. Uh, I stream on Twitch occasionally because I've been bad recently um, at uh, twitch.tv slash Infinity Artifacts. I play this game on Twitch and then I am on the Commander Rules Committee. So I help make rules for this format <laughs> and I play dress up a lot for <laughs> WotC. So I also cosplay because <laughs> why not? I do other stuff too. Anyway, hi, thanks, bye. All right, Ben. Hi, I'm, I'm Ben. I'm Ben or Professor Broman uh, on the internet box uh, set top. Uh, <laughs> and then I, I tell everybody who my commander is. Yeah, is that yeah. it? Yeah. All right, my commander is Shraz the Silent King. He's a legend. Yeah, like, you already know it's a legendary creature because <laughs> we're playing this format. Jesus. Um, flying, my will be done. Whenever Sarah attacks, mill three cards. You may put an artifact creature card or vehicle card from among the cards milled this way into your hand. Oh, nice. that's such a sick effect. That's nice. <laughs> it looks nice. so dope. I'm sure, I'm sure I'll use it very poorly. <laughs> <laughs> to to ill effect um, oh and then i also stream on twitch oh yes yeah yeah sorry the rest <laughs> of the stuff i stream on twitch and i'm <laughs> professor bro man everywhere if you know me you know me probably from from playing destiny back in the day and getting a world first on the king's yeah. fall dlc yeah so that's where you know me from playing sorry oh and uh <laughs> and uh and 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 now i think we're gonna go back to olivia so she can tell everybody who she's playing right sorry i forgot that part was kind of important um <laughs> So I am running, I was, well, it popped into my head because I was like, oh, you should play this deck that I'm playing and didn't tell anybody about. So this is, we're all playing pre-cons for anybody that's new to this. So these are all decks that were made by WotC and are sold as a complete package instead of you building your own. So I'm playing Lathril Blade of the Elves. This is an elf ball deck. So it's just a lot of elves and they all do elf stuff. And they all say like, hey, when another elf enters the battlefield and they're all elves. So a lot of those things occur. Um, these two decks that this one came with was another like spirits or something. This is from Kaldheim precon. 
These were the ones that were like 20 bucks MSRP when they came out and are genius and brilliant. Precons generally run 40 to $50 unless it's Commander Masters, but we don't talk about that. <laughs> um, those are, they're great ways to start. They are still complicated. It is not like, uh, you know, Fisher Price level of magic, but they are cohesive. They will make sense and they will yeah. work. So if you do end up buying precons, just spend whatever you feel comfortable and then ask people about stuff and we'll help you. Yeah. Sick. All right, Timmy, what you got? Sorry yes. about that. Hey, my name's Tim. Uh, also go by Darkness429 on the interwebs. And I'll be playing Zolodok. We're doing my uh, Eldrazi pre-con today. Nice. All colorless all the time. All righty, mm, let's, yeah. let's roll a dice. If you have a dice, we can... See who starts. I don't have any dice. Okay, <laughs> we'll roll for you. All good. Okay, what are we rolling? I don't know. Oh, I love. love your what do you got, Tim? Dice. Oh, I got. Oh, I got a five. Whoop. I got a six. Look at me. Oh, so did I. Look at that spike feeder's Whoop. cactus. All right, I'll roll for Ben. Whoop. Okay, Ben got a five. Okay, Olivia, you and I going first is boring. Yeah, that's so dumb. So let's let's roll to see who picks who goes first. How's yeah. That? Okay. All right. I got whoop. A four. Beat that. Six. God damn you. Okay. <laughs> Necron Dynasties. First. Let's go. Ne Mono Black Necron artifacts. Dynasties. <laughs> Mono <laughs> artifacts. I'm in. Let's let's do this. I should roll the bucket. I'm not gonna roll the bucket. No. <laughs> I don't want to. I do not want to play Dice the Gathering. But thank no. you. That's a great <laughs> suggestion. Sometime. All right. All right. So. Ben, you are going Me. first in a game okay. of Commander and nowhere else. If you are on the play, you will also draw. So draw a card to start your okay. turn. Okay. All then right. Thank you. He All has right. No idea what he's in for, does he? I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. I, I know now. It. I know now. If I have a land, I play that. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. yeah. right, there you wow. Go. He's way ahead of where I was right. when I started. I got so I got this swamp right here. So now yes. I have one. The swamp. Right. Uh huh. Yeah. Oh, powerful. Uh -huh. And then I don't think I have. Does uh, anything have a. a just no, I don't think a I have anything that has a one cost. Swap. Then you're going to pass the turn. Okay. All right. Then I pass. Okay. Yeah. I have one. Yeah. I have Look one at that swap. first turn, everybody. Good. Oh, yeah, great oh first turn. turn. <laughs> great work. Great Dude, can I just say, I had so much anxiety about this today, and y'all have made me feel like, <laughs> like no anxiety at all. I feel so comfortable. Hell yeah. The best. I'm going to play my land, and that's the end of my turn. I will draw as per the rules. Ooh, that's nice. I'm going to play this here forest, and then I will tap it to plane cycle eagles of the north so this will let me go and get a planes from my library put it into my hand and this birdie will go into my graveyard so that is my turn friends i am never punished <laughs> greedy keeps huh? i'm gonna be so greedy i'm gonna play a forest in bed all right so i draw all right neat so i'm gonna ask you a question is yeah. there a difference between a land and an artifact land what no no, no unless no. you have things that care about the number of artifacts you have and that deck, right. I okay. think there is if there it, definitely are i saw the word yes, a lot there are <laughs> um yeah but an artifact land it still doesn't have a mana cost up in that top corner <laughs> so you can okay it yeah as if it were. okay yeah, just a as regular a old okay player. cool cool then i will i will play that <laughs> vault of whispers but i don't have anything that's a two cost because i'm okay. a pro that's chill. Uh, yeah, Hold so it. I guess that means I'm done. Yeah. I'm so happy to hear that you were anxious and now you are no longer anxious. Oh, if I feel we, great. If people, great. If people come into Commander and they're nervous and they don't like have people helping them out, we've done something wrong. Yeah. That, that's the end of my oh. turn. Just a land and pass? Yeah. Just a land okay. and pass. Untap, draw. That's the one frustrating Ooh. thing about the Eldrazi deck is that it takes a little bit to get going. Yeah, the oh, numbers yeah. are oh, big. Pre -cons, pre -cons big. do take a while as well, so. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, let's just I'm get this loving done. the also, chats right now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, scattered Groves, this enters tapped, and I too will pass the turn. The first three turns of Commander, we just like, you know, skip through generally. Yeah, this is this not is much pretty happens. chill stuff. Yeah, this is yeah. super chill. I'm yeah. really glad that like turn two, people didn't like throw out like five monsters. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, that's nice. I would have been panicking. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> All right. That is, that's not what we're doing here. When Especially what Ailey like uh, mentioned to me on Discord. She was just like, yeah, somebody's first time. I was like, okay. So I'm going to find a pre-con. I'm going to pick a bad <laughs> hand on purpose. And I'm not going to showboat. I'm going to play a Golgari rot farm, which enters tapped, and I have to bounce the land to my hand. <laughs> oh, you may have eight cards in hand then, don't you? That's a bad idea. It's not, though, because I can play something. Okay. I just wasn't going to. 
play Do something it. then. Let don't, me. Don't, I'm, okay. Yeah. Uh, no, I'm gonna. Sh I, I will now show how it was. How <laughs> nah, it would be done Do smartly. It. I, it's not full showboating. I can't showboat, but I am deliberately not showboating. <laughs> if you don't stomp me into the ground, I swear. <laughs> He's asking okay. for it. Okay. He has so literally just said, "Olivia, step on me." So. What? No. Who uh, yeah, <laughs> am I to say no? Okay. So we're gonna play this out the Angie way instead. So I'm gonna tap the forest for the soul ring I just drew because obviously I'm gonna tap that to play an arcane signet. And then I will play a Golgari rot farm which will enter tapped. I'll bounce the forest back to my hand. I can already see him being like, what the f happened? There's the soul ring. Yeah, there nah, it is. This is cool. Stuff's happening. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right, all right. We will continue the steps. I'll pass. So, yeah, so Ben, those two artifacts are the two most played in Commander, like yes. bar none. These So soul ring, if you go soul ring, which makes two mana that lets you add the arcade signet down and then okay. the nuts is absolutely having a one drop thereafter so it's pretty gross right okay now. my turn oh <laughs> you're not gonna i gotta draw okay yeah all right <laughs> oh you're not gonna believe it but i'm gonna i'm gonna play <laughs> a land here we go that's a good start yeah that's a good start <laughs> yeah uh-huh uh and then oh yeah uh that's it <laughs> Chat's calling me out. <laughs> How dare. <laughs> How dare. Nothing but land right now. That'll be it. The next turn, though, watch out. Oh, yeah. All right. I will then Same, get a critter down. I'm going to pay three for a tireless provisioner. This creature has a landfall, and it says whenever a land enters the battlefield under my control, I can either make a food token or a treasure token. Food is something I can sacrifice to gain three life, which this deck cares about a lot. And a treasure token is a little one use only artifact that gives me mana. And that is my turn. I will draw. I remain unpunished. Uh, I'll play first. <laughs> I will pay three for an Elvish Archdruid. Uh, other elf creatures I control get plus one, plus one. I can tap it to add green for each elf I control. I will pass. Please. All right, here we go. All right, we're drawing. So I have, okay, there. A little land situation. And then... Tim has a cult? No, it's a community under the leadership of Tim. Yeah, yeah, huh? It's just, <laughs> it's an acronym. So wait, Cult of Tim, but that's like saying ATM machine. Yeah, right, yes. it's just it's just yeah. C-U-L-T. Yeah. It's just community under leadership of Tim. Understood. Or saying yeah, Chai yeah. T. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I got mm -hmm. it. It's another yeah. one. <laughs> yeah, it's not a cult. It's a community. Okay. Exactly. Thank you. Get it. Thank you. You get it. All right. So if I wanted to play it's a card now, let's get something <laughs> out on the field, <laughs> and it costs four... Yep. I would just tap these <laughs> and then play it, right? You're goddamn uh, right, man. You got this. All right. Yeah, like that. Yeah, uh -huh. as long as you tap and land. Yeah, look at me, bro. He's a left then... tapper. Everybody Things freak are out. occurring. What does that mean? <laughs> oh, no. no, you're good. You're good. There are people that are terminally online that are like, I do things differently, so I can't oh. handle somebody oh, doing I see. it a different oh, way. Oh, oh, you can only do you're it one way? Fine. Well, guess this. Worry well, not. What? You need to tap them at 45 degrees mm -hmm. oh, to the tough. left and oh, really like that? get people going. Oh, that really just like, what if I just wanted to like have it sort of staggered? There you go. Is, would that yeah, be okay? There we go. Oh, like Richard like Garfield it. intended. Actually, if you really want to mess stuff up, put lands at the very top of your play Matt put lands in front oh no oh, oh. and watch the engagement <laughs> all right tap them, tap them upside down oh no oh, yes boy. chaos oh this is great you just told me that I could do a bunch of things that'll irritate people that are meaningless so that's Look, great shots are so mad at me do not have it do that <laughs> Do not! <laughs> Don't you just, do that! You can't! Okay, uh, so oh, I'm gonna can't. play... <laughs> like God and Richard Garfield intended. Oh. <laughs> what you got, Ben? Amazing. Uh, so I've got the ghost arc here, all right? So I'm gonna... Do yeah. I need I need to read everything out on here, right? Yeah, I don't know for what everyone should. Listening I mean, it might be in. more right, helpful yeah, so, for you. So, yeah, it's probably yeah. a ghost arc, right? So uh, it's got a repair barge whenever ghost arc becomes crude. Uh, each artifact creature in your graveyard gains honor three until the end of the turn. Crew two is a uh, tap any number of creatures uh, you control with a total of two power or more. And this vehicle becomes an artifact until the end of the turn. So crewing is basically you got to put something in the ship to drive the ship. 
need the ship. Yeah, <laughs> you don't right. Need a captain for you. Need boat. a captain. Yeah. So <laughs> once you have a creature out, and most I don't know if you've got any other creatures for next turn, but your commander, for example, I think it's more than two power. You'll be able to tap him, and then the boat comes to life and is able to whack okay. something. So I don't. So I just have to tap any creature with a score of of yeah. two or more. Okay. Exact. Yeah. Oh, you got it. <laughs> He's out here. For now. <laughs> <laughs> and then that's yeah, that's the end of my turn. Okay. Uh play it land, and then we'll tap, 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 tap. We'll bring out Solomon Simal Smallcrum. It's an artifact. Sad robot. Now. Yeah, that. Uh, and then when he comes out onto the battlefield, I get to search my deck for a basic land, and I get to put that on the battlefield tapped. So I'm going to do that real quick. Mm -hmm. Anything of, else, Tim? That's the end of my turn. All right. Just shuffling. Um, dip it, dip it, dip. Draw. Ooh, a nice. Okay. I'm going to do something cool. I would also like to ram. So I'm going to play this planes. The planes will trigger Tireless Provisioner. I'm going to make a treasure token which I'm going to sacrifice immediately. Add one to my mana pool, two, three, four, five, to cost Call for Unity, which is an enchantment that says, at the beginning of your end step, if a permanent you controlled left the battlefield this turn, put a counter on Call for Unity. Creatures you control get plus one, plus one for each counter on Call of Unity. So something left my battlefield, it was the treasure token. I'll put a counter on Call of Unity, and now my creatures are gonna get chunky every time mm -hmm. something leaves my battlefield so this is now a four well it will be at the beginning of my end step it'll be a four do i want to hit anyone i kind of do olivia what oh. i love you no you don't so this is all end step you, you don't you don't need yet, to lie on camera i do love you like, that That's doesn't, that doesn't make it true yeah leave uh. the dm <laughs> I will bop you for three, friend. Oh my god, those t those words gave me so much anxiety. Yeah, okay, I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> and then end step, this will get a counter, and now next yeah. turn this will be four power. Yo That's my dokey. I'll untap, I will draw. <laughs> well, that's not very helpful. I will play another foray. How do I make Ailey regret her actions? You hit me. That's too easy. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to be aware that I'm not causing you any damage. It's all your own psychic damage. <laughs> all right. I will lay out my commander, Lathril, Blade of Elves. Menace, whenever she deals combat damage to a player, I make that many 1-1 one, one green elf warrior creature tokens. I can tap 10 untapped elves to make each opponent lose 10 life and me gain 10 life. Oh, that's rude. I need yeah. very many elves, though. I'm yeah. eight shy currently. I will then tap three. I'm gonna play Elder Fang Venom. It's an enchantment. Attacking elves I control get death touch. And whenever an elf I control dies, each opponent loses a life and I gain a life. I will pass the turn. It's my turn, so I'm gonna do it, draw. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna do it. Yeah. Okay. So when it says instant, it doesn't mean I have to cast it right away. It no. means the effect becomes active when I cast it. I don't I can't. And you okay. can cast it at virtually any time. Yeah. Okay, all right, sick. That's great. Did you guys know I just got an instant cast card? I just, just no, dude. To, uh, this is your first oh game, God. and we're yeah, learning. No, no, no. I know. I'm just because making fun of myself. That's okay, <laughs> though, because this is this is the like one time it's good for maybe us to have some of that information, so we yeah. can help mm. you play better, so right. you know yeah. what to expect and how the mechanics work. Yeah, thanks. That makes sense. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. So I'm trying. I'm trying to. Big jug of water. Hold. Tim, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Tim rocks the water, right? <laughs> Oh, that's hydration. All right, so I'm going to tap these cards here, right? Or I saw you do it like this, like you're counting, like you're doing four so you can track it because the creature is four. Mm -hmm. is, that, is that strats? Okay, cool. Uh, and I'm going to play the Tomb Blade. Uh, it's an artifact creature flying. So whenever the Tomb Blade deals damage to a player, that player loses life equal to the number of creatures they control unless uh, they sacrifice a creature. Ooh. Um, Wait, how much How much does that cost? Is that six? It says four, and then two it's skulls. It's four swamp swamp, so it's yeah. a total of six. Total of six. Oh, okay, yeah. that's what I thought. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. okay, all right, okay. okay. So I was still learning how to later. math. Yeah, yeah. No, we yeah. are not. Do not write it down. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. 
Stop it. No, I'll write it down. Okay, cool. Well, I have this. I have this swamp that I could play. There you go. Um, Good. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. And then See, okay, anything... so if you grab a swamp or another mana thing next turn, then you would be able to play. Then I yeah. would be able to play it, right? And then I, yeah, I don't have anything unless I want to. No, this yeah, you guy can bring out is... your commander. Okay, yeah, totally. all right. So, and that's four. Three okay, black and then one generic. Okay, now I understand. There you go. Right. Hey! Okay. Oh, oh, I understand. All right, there it is. The neurons right. made the connection. You get there. We got there, dude. Yeah. <laughs> now I can math. <laughs> um, that also threw me off then... when I started playing. It's got flying. <laughs> yeah. On it. So then, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, so when you play the commander or creature card, I guess, they come out. They land like that. So anytime you okay, play a yeah. creature, unless it has the word haste on it, it cannot attack the same turn. Okay, It can't right. be tapped for an ability the same turn. Sweet. Would you like to hit something? Uh Oh, I can. I can hit you something. Can. You sure can, uh, buddy. What, what, what card does Tim have out there that I can't uh, see? I've got a 2-2. I've, two -two. I've got the Solemn yeah. Simulacrum. Yeah. Um, so Hey Tim, this is where you encourage Ben to swing at you. Yeah, yeah, hit me. <laughs> yeah? Huh. That's really interesting that you want me what to do thing? that. Yeah, you tattooed because... bald. Come on. <laughs> now, now, that, I feel like you'd be doing this because of the effects of that card. Which might oh make it no, intelligent. No, no. So the only thing, the only thing is, is that this is a two-two. Uh -huh. So you, what, what is your guy? A three-four? Three, four, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. so if I was to defend with this card, I would lose my card, and then I would, and, and that would be it. Right. So I would, I would end up Ooh. losing this, or I Wait. can take, or I can Wait. take the three damage. Wha well, uh, sorry. Also, if he dies, I get to draw a card. So, ah. so that's so the only he... reason why I would sacrifice him is if I wanted right. to get another card out onto the field. So ah. there are times where people will incentivize attacks because they have cards that if they die or oh. block or whatever, get them an additional benefit. Solemn Simulacrum is one of them. Like it's always used as a blocker because you get to get a card from it. Yeah. That is good. Value. So I could <laughs> right. do that or I could just take your three damage if I wanted There's to that keep too. him on, on the field for a little bit of defense. He, he could yeah. also just be a little <laughs> and take it in the face. Wow, that's true. That's true. I'm, a grown, I'm just gonna. Thank you I, very much. I'm I just a grown. grown thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna attack Tim. Cool. I'm okay. gonna attack Tim because it feels like the right first thing to do. Yeah, yeah. I, I will block. First, first blood. I will block. It's my first attack is punching a card. Tim can't block? block. Does the thing fly? Oh, you hit me oh, with that commander. Right. It's flying. Oh, I can't. No, 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 You're no, no, right. no. It's the it's the boat. No, no, it's the no. yeah. He's attacking with the boat. Wait, but so, he doesn't have to cruise. It has flying. He yeah. does. So here's what okay. we gotta do. All right, we're clarifying Wait, oh, for Tim. Oh, so I can't this. attack Tim yet? You can. You're fine. Here's what oh, you do. Okay. You say we're gonna we're gonna pretend we were not in combat yet, and you're going to say before I go to combat, I'm going to crew the ghost arc. Oh, okay. Yeah. Doesn't he need two cards to crew it? No, no, he just needs two no, power. He needs power. Oh, he needs two, two power. Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah, and I thought that too. We know that yeah, his yeah. commander has that. So you're going to tap yeah. down. So tap your commander. Can't, uh, can't, even though it's his first, he just yes. came because out. Because yes. you're paying the ability on Ghost Dark. You are not tapping him. The Ghost Dark is making you tap a creature. Yeah. Okay. All right. It's I a, see. Right. Okay. All right. Beautiful. But then, yes, we oversimplified uh, that way to put it. So it now Ghost flying. Dark. Yes. Now Ghost Dark has flying yep. and can swing. It is and I cannot. And I cannot block. No, because it, it has flying. flying. Yeah. Oh. The only, that, the only way that I could block is if I had flying. Or reach. I did, did it! You did it! Yeah! Yeah! Yay! I will take the three. And then I flex my muscles so everybody could see that yours were bigger, so don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't have I have I have more clothing on, so you take the <laughs> <laughs> So, Let's so go. generous. Good job. Let's go. All right. You did it. That was your first combat. Phase. I did it! Okay. I did combat turn! <laughs> One last thing, Ghost Dark, you need to tap because you used it to attack and things okay. tap when they're attacking unless they have the word vigilance on them. All okay. right, we're all set then. Yay! And now we're going to win the, the whole thing. game. <laughs> Probably. Yeah, that deck is, deck is kind of gross. It yeah. is really nasty. It, really, it is really mean. Uh, is it the end of your turn? Yes, so you have anything I my turn. Do? Nothing else to do? I don't do? think so. Okay, I will untap, keep and draw. I will summon my commander. Zolodok is out on the field. <laughs> okay, so for Zolodok, anytime I cast a uh, mana seven or greater is when I get to Cascade. Uh, ben, ca <laughs> ben Cascade is I get to keep pulling cards from my deck until I get a creature spell. And it has to be uh, of, uh, of equal of cool. equal of equal equal mana value. So if I, when I play a card, let's say I play like a seven mana card, 
then anything that is seven or under, I can then I, I instantly. It's or is it six? It just has six, to be, it's six, it's it six and everything else. Than, so yeah. it's less yeah. than gotcha. seven. So anything that's under that, and then I can instantly play it onto the field. Yeah. Gotcha. It's pretty okay. gross. Major discounts. Ben hit me and he has nothing left. So I'm going to hit him with the two. Good job. <laughs> wow. Fine. Sorry, Ben. Yeah. It's okay. That's what we call the crackback. Ah. Right. Now <laughs> I am done. All right. Leaving yourself shields down and then just getting just hit raw. back for what you just did. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Hello. Okay. All right. I will play. There's Brian Kibler saying hi. Hello. Hello, hey, Brian. Hi. hi, Brian. Everybody said hi, Brian. <laughs> We've done it. Rogue's Passage. Uh, Rogue's Passage. For my land for turn, I'm going to make. <gasps> and hello, go. Oh, hi, Bubbas. Oh, no. <laughs> Food. <gasps> hi, puppy. Get Come here, dog okay. video. Yeah. Oh, no, he's, Yo, ghost he's dog. disappearing into the ether. Ghost dog. <laughs> oh, you're ghost dog. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna make a food token this time around. Okay. Oko does have phasing now, yeah. He phased. <laughs> <laughs> but his claws didn't on my shoulder. Right, no, I decided I'm gonna make a treasure token instead. I like mana. So then do, 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 do. mana mana. Do, 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 do. Then we're gonna move to combat and I'm gonna swing. How big is Zula Doc, Tim? Uh seven four. <laughs> okay, well I have a four three. I'm gonna <laughs> swing. Those at you, numbers Tim. are large. Yeah. Would you like to block? No, because I just got him out on the field. <laughs> don't, don't right. I'm going to bop you for four. Yeah, that's the one thing that sucks oh, about him crap. is he becomes target instantly. As soon well, as and that out. in the he's got a, a small butt in comparison to the power. Yeah. yeah, yeah, tiny butt. When people talk about butts, they're talking about toughness of a creature. Yeah. As my um, guess. Yeah. Shoot. Based on so, the fact that y'all were talking about how he couldn't tank that hit, or it would put his take his command. Uh, yeah, it would kill his creature. I'm gonna, gonna get my commander out. Mana. Look at this galaxy brain over here. It's with a tiny butt. Bilbo. So Bilbo says, if I would gain life, I gain that much plus one instead, and then if I get to 111 or more life, I get to activate his ability and get all the creatures from my deck onto the battlefield. Bad news. This is my 111th birthday. Yes. Wow, what a party. If you get to 111 HP, I will be very impressed. Thank you. I will I'm do my best to I'm make sure it doesn't happen. Try. Thank you. Thank you so <laughs> you, much. No. Um, you will try. You will fail. I will, okay. I am just going to then forest cycle generous ent. So similar thing to the bird. It goes into my bin. I fetch a forest, put it into my hand. And that is my turn. A permanent left. So my call for unity has two counters on it. So everything is plus two now. I believe right. I should become a problem on purpose. Do it. Do it. I'm going to try. We'll draw. Oh, and a, a good rule of thumb, I guess, for commander games is don't be afraid to kill people. If I have a problem, yeah. Otherwise, it, they go on there. for a real long time. Yeah. yeah. Just dunk on people if you can. Don't be a d about it. But you know, games do gotta end. Yes. <laughs> what if I do both of these? Because I'm the worst. Allow me a moment to count really fast. Green, <laughs> green makes you count, and I'm bad at math. So I'm gonna tap four. I'm gonna keep that black floating from Golgari Rot Farm since that taps for green and black. I'm gonna play Elvish Promenade, which is create a 1-1 one, one green elf warrior creature token for each elf I control. I control two, so I will make two tokens. Uh, she's ramping smart. her elves. She's heating up! Oh, can I just dump my hand? Yeah. I hope not. Well, I d d no, I hope so. I'm learning right, so much from it. chat right now about how everyone else's decks work. <laughs> <laughs> That's good! It's good. Yeah, they're That's like helpful. green makes you green makes you count uh my mod said green makes you count for real. You want to summon this green creature, that'll be six forests and three extra mana. Yeah, green goes burr a lot. <laughs> <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna use this black, the arcane signet, and the soul ring. I'll leave one floating. The signet's for green. For Harald, King of Skemfar. Uh, he's got Menace. Whenever he ETBs, look at the top five cards of my library. It can reveal an elf, a warrior, or a Tyvar card from among them and put it into my hand. Rest on the bottom of the library in random order. One, two, three, four, and five. I'd have I don't to like do... that you have all these choices. I know, right? Isn't I'm growing best? concerned. <laughs> you should. Okay. I am going to reveal Jagged Scar Archers. Mm -hmm. I think. Is that what I want to reveal? Too late. 
<laughs> is that black? I, yeah, yeah, it is. It is. This is fine. This is fine. So jagged <laughs> scar into my hand. The rest on the bottom of the library, which I will not dump, even though these are brand new sleeves. And I'm, oh my goodness, that was close. Okay. And then just to be an absolute menace, I'm going to tap the Elvish Archdruid for one, two, three, four, five, and play Voice of Many. When the ETVs, I draw a card for each opponent who controls fewer creatures than me. That's all of us. Yes, so I'll draw three cards. <laughs> Gross. It's really funny. So I meant to mention this in the beginning. I have advocated and recommended this deck to numerous people. It's like, oh man, if you really want to just get good and see what value and synergy mean in Magic, get Lathril yeah. Blade of Elves. I have never played it. I only ever looked at the deck list and was like, this seems okay. <laughs> kind of want and this And recommended deck. it to people. Now that I'm playing, I was like, oh no, I made a bunch of monsters. <laughs> It's like I, I really want to play this real deck now. Stuff real fast. <laughs> so I've got one, two floating and nothing to do with it. Beautiful. This is all gross. Uh, okay. So you friends entered the battlefield this time, so you can't swing here. So I have Lathril. Uh, bro, man, <laughs> I'm going to send two at you. Oh, cool. Just a little Lost tap. this mana floating, and that's it. I'll pass. All right. Cool. Wipe the was... board. Wipe the board. <laughs> Shush! <laughs> Nobody asked you. That's what I'm hoping for. <laughs> what, are you hoping that I do that? Well, why would hoping I be somebody able to does. do that? You're playing black. Black is death, basically. <laughs> okay. Actually, yeah, um, wipe the board so I can make you all lose that many, that much life in the elves oh, yeah. that I lose. Oh, yeah. Right. Wait, what? Is like all kinds of retribution happening? Yeah. I got a vengeance. Oh, it's I'm nice screaming that you want to do that. Stab. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. Make my elf tokens from Lathril? Oh, that's right. I did combat damage to a player, right, so I have two more elves. Here. All right. So I think I know what I want to do. I think the total here is four for this guy, so I'm going to tap four, right? And I'm going to play. Sorry, I know that makes everyone mad. Uh, Don't worry about it. <laughs> uh, it's the the Scorpith Destroyer. It's a Necron artifact. It has Death Touch, Hyperphase, Ooh, death Threshers. Touch. Uh, whenever an artifact enters the battlefield under your control, Scorpith Destroyer gains first strike until end of turn. Okay. Oh boy. You guys were making a sweaty kinda... magic gamer. I kind of, I kind of want to, I kind of want to f with him some more. Oh, um, yeah. hold, on, hold on, hold up a second. <laughs> I've got the least amount of, of a health. Okay, right you now. know what? Well, I, you okay. might be the only person that doesn't kill me. Okay, I'm just trying. Be you can you can hit me. I, I will um, say I'm gonna start doing some real gross things, and this yeah. deck gains a lot of okay. life. So feel free to come. All right. Me. Yeah. Um. So Get her. then, in that <laughs> case, I will uh, Sarketh. I'll attack with Sarketh. Attack. So Edith. just uh, before yeah. you, you finish declaring, is his an attack trigger or when he does damage? It's attack, right? Whenever attacks. Yeah. Okay. There you go. So oh, you you'll resolve that first before I declare any blockers or effects. Or okay. Anything. All right, so so that means I mill the three cards now. Yes. And that means like I just pull them and then they get discarded. Straight, straight minus... the yeah, they yeah. straighten to the bin. He's learning well, so much. You're doing so good. Well then. This is not an easy deck to start on. Necron no. He's so like. I feel like it has a it, there. I feel like there's like a few synergistic like through threads that I'm like yes. trying to look yeah. for on the cards. Yes, I just absolutely. try to make. If you don't know what you're doing and you want to tip yeah. from old Professor Broman about anything, <laughs> just try and find words that match. And that, then you that, follow the matching words. And that is the very <laughs> big thing that they try to do with pre-cons is yeah. make words match up and make yeah. them so, oh, if I play this, it makes sense to play this. That's yeah. one of the whole guiding things with these. Also, the milled cards will be face up. So we'll see what oh. it is you've milled yeah, if yeah. you want to confer oh, okay. with us about you know what, what to keep. Oh, okay. So I have the Sanopec spider oh uh, that one's pretty good yeah which is good but i also have Traz in the infinite as long as Traz in the infinite is on the battlefield it has all activated abilities of all artifact cards in your graveyard there they are prismatic gallery okay and then the spider is the flying and then it's that one is uh whenever another non-token artifact creature or vehicle enters the battlefield under your control draw a card Okay, so none of them have activated abilities. So pick yeah, which so. one you like the look of most in this instance. Oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. I would say I would recommend the spider. I yeah, I feel like I would like to draw cards. Yes, so that is correct. I will do that, and then 
Uh, okay, so now attacking. Uh, <laughs> now, before you attack, do you want to use your your car or no? I do. Back. So I need to crew the car. Got a crew before, before you go. My attack. Yep. Turn. Yeah, you got okay, it. Okay, so that's the poem. Uh, yeah, that's right. Yes, that I forgot the poem, but remember the lesson. <laughs> that's the important part, honestly. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so, so I guess that means I'm attacking Edith with both of these. Yeah, Is sure. That... Uh, yeah, so you'll okay. then you sure can. them both, uh -huh. and they're right. both flying. Yes. Yeah. All right, I can't do anything about that. So, what's your total power? They're three plus three, so six. All right, so I take six, and one of them is commandy damage. So I will track that. And do they have any when deals combat damage effects? I forget what the arc does. The arc says whenever the arc becomes crude, each artifact creature in your graveyard gains under three until the end of the turn. So you can just pay three mana for anything in the bin? Yeah, that's that's what it <sighs> seems like. So you want to fill that bin with big chunguses then? Yeah. Oh, Gross. big chungus. Big chungus. <laughs> I'm excited. Ugh. Okay, that's disgusting and I love it. All right, yeah, I take your damage and continue with your turn if you've got anything else. Um, I don't for the future. Oh, yeah, I, I don't have to send all my creatures to the same person. Well, she said yeah. she's going to be a jerk. I am going to mean jerk. stuff. Yes, she is. So I'm going to be mean first. I, I think yeah, that's it. I don't it have anything like post Solid attack. Plan. <laughs> yeah. Good I'm, I'm good. Untap. Keep Ooh. Oh. Can Tim cost something for seven mana? I know, that's what I was really hoping for. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It didn't happen. Um, oh. two, two. I'm going to pay two. I will place my artifact down, Endless Atlas. And then I'll cool. tap another two, and I will draw a card. Activate only if you control three or more lands with the same name. I do. I don't know How I do. dare you? I do. And, oh, sick. Let's see. Ben's got nothing. And uh, your elves are really scary. No, they're not. They're just little one ones. They're really scary. They don't even gain you life unless Very you kill scary. them, and then they do, and they hurt you as well. Don't gain you life if you have ten. We're all in big. <laughs> no, then you only lose ten. What are you so worried about, life gain deck? Uh, <laughs> Keep and then your I'll, pants on. I'll tap the last three, and I will summon uh, Matter Reshaper. Oh. And then uh, when Matter Reshaper dies, reveal the top card of your library. You may put that card onto the battlefield if it's a permanent card with the mana value three or less. Otherwise, put that okay. card into your hand. So nothing too crazy, but you know, it's there. And you've got Bilbo, and you've got... What's Bilbo's power? He is a 4-5 at the moment. If you'd like your Solemn Simulacrum to die, I will gladly kill it. Ah... Sure. Let's send the Ooh, bargain. That's you. another that was... thing we do in Commander. Yeah, a little politic. politicking. Uh -huh. Yeah, a little yeah. politicking. Yeah, yeah. That's nice. So mind games are accepted here. Yes. All right. Well, then I will sell. I will send the solemn at you. I will block it, and it will perish. Thank you for killing it. You're welcome. And we were good. That is the end of my turn. Sweet. On your end step, I'm going to pay one. And Olivia, I love you, but left will scare no, you the crap out of me, so I'm going to make you slow down a little bit with Path to Exile. Okay. I'm going to exile your friend. Nope, and, that's fine. And uh, you're going to get another land. See, I'm helping you ramp. I like how you think you actually did something helpful for yourself, but... Okay. I just, I know Lathril does dumb things, so... My hand does dumber stuff, but... Oh, okay. I will untap and draw. I will play a forest. Tyra's provisional treasure. Well, trigger, and I'll get a treasure. I'm going to pay black with the treasure because I don't have a swamp yet. I'm going to cost Rapacious Guest. This is a menacing to-do that says whenever one or more creatures you control deal combat damage to a player, create a food token, and whenever I sacrifice a food, I put a 1-1 counter on Rapacious Guest. Mm. When this leaves the battlefield, target opponent loses life equal to its power. ho oh. ho ho. Yeah. Okay. Let's make you fat. I am then going to move to combat. Tim, the new creature that arrived, how big is it? Three, two. Oh, it's just a whittle one. Okay. It's just a whittle uh, guy. Ben is also tapped out. So I'm going to send this five, four at Tim, and then this four, five at Ben. Five and four. Sweet. I got our friends. <laughs> I will. I, I like friends hit each other in this game. Yeah. Friends do hit each other. <laughs> I will block with matter reshaper. Okay. And then when he dies, uh, if the mana value is three or less, I can play it. And if not, it just goes in my hand. All right. So let's resolve that. It is not. So it goes in my hand. 
getting wrecked. Yep. But that's valid. Uh, I think, yeah, at the top of your library. All right. So then, yeah, Bubba will smack. Yeah. A rapacious guest will trigger and whatever one or more. So it's just one food token I get. Nom, 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 nom. Do I want cards? Let's get cards. I will pay four in my second main phase for harmonize, which says draw three cards. Easy peasy. Whoop. Yes, yes. Right, end step. The treasure left my battlefield, so I will then put another counter on call for unity. So everything is now plus three, plus three. That's my turn. Uh, this is where Olivia Alpha strikes me out of nowhere. I'm going to do my best. <laughs> so I have seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 available. Right. Holy crap. Yeah, it's okay. Don't worry, it's fine. Oh, nah. No. So hear me out. What if I pay four and I will play on my main step at instant speed? Uh, elven ambush and create a one one green elf warrior creature token for each elf I control. Oh God. Ew. So I'll make seven more. So I'll <laughs> total of 14 elves. Uh -huh. Okay. All right. If anyone has a board wipe card, please <laughs> okay. play it. <laughs> Just for the love of God. <laughs> <laughs> what what would those look like? Uh, destroy say, all it, creatures. Yeah, destroy okay. I'll say creatures, something about yeah. yeah, just sending them to the afterlife. <laughs> okay. Just I probably like have something like that. Oh my god! What? It's a d20 with 60 numbers carved into it. It's a big giant spin down, quite literally, because like it does actually do the spins. Cool. This way, when things get a little out of hand, I have a, a quick and easy way to. Yeah. <laughs> so whatever number is facing the top and readable is the number it's on. Okay, so now That's I have so cool. more mana. I'll use one black Elvish Arch Druid to get 14, 15, 16, 17 mana there. <laughs> Everything's fine, don't worry. So one black and then three green for a huh. poison tip archer. Oh, good, okay. Reach and death touch whenever another creature dies, each opponent loses a life. That's any creature, not just- Any yours. creature. Oh boy. Yes. Uh, what? What? Okay. Don't worry about it. All right, then uh, fine. Okay. So I'll tap the swamp and then pay five more for a roll to come back out. I will use three green, the arcane signet for a black for pride of the perfect. Elves I control get plus two plus zero. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. Ooh, Lord, she's smacking. <laughs> yeah, Ben, that is the correct face. For this. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, girls right. can't play magic. It's fine. Um, <laughs> Clearly, that's an incorrect statement. <laughs> <laughs> my boyfriend built me this deck. Um, and by my boyfriend, I apparently mean Watsy. Uh, I will pay three for Elvish Rejuvenator. When it ETBs, I'll look at the top five cards in my library. I can put a land from among them onto the battlefield tapped and the rest on the bottom of my library. That land will be a command tower. Cool, 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 cool. I will then, yeah, what the hell. I'll play Jagged Scar Archers, which is a 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 21. Power and toughness equal to the number of creatures you control? Elves I control. Oh, good. Dance game. 21. <laughs> Twitch emote. Okay. okay. <laughs> Problems on purpose. And then you okay. go to the end of your turn, right? No. <sighs> so these friends can attack. <laughs> Four of the elves I made. Oh boy. This there's is gross. And here that can't. And there's 14 total, but four of them are tappable and attackable. Ailey. Hi. Hey, friend. Hi, friend. So. What you got there, uh, bud? <laughs> well, mm -hmm. it's funny you should ask. I have four, four, two elves, a six, three elf, uh -huh. and, and a six, four elf. So six, three is six, four, and four, four, twos, you said? Yes. Are they all coming to me? Yes. Oh, come on. Spread the love. <laughs> You're a life king deck. You were trying to hurt me. <laughs> All right, I'll spread the luck. Um, but no, then you're gonna be. I, then you're gonna do something. And I'm gonna be mad that I didn't just full swing at you. Yes, you yeah. will. Be. Yeah. So mm. no, I'm. Uh, yes. Uh, All twenty two coming at you. Twenty two. Oi! Isn't that more? Oh my god. Four, eight, 12, Six, 16, 16, plus 12. 16 Oh yeah, this twenty. 
I told you I was bad at math! I said so! Okay, fine. Uh, I will block... This is a 5-5 five five currently, so I'm going to block one of your four twos with it. My elves so all have I'll death take... touch. Oh, f***! <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> death touch, man. Um, <laughs> Alright, yeah. I will then block the biggest one. And it's a 5-5? Five five? The 6 four. Yeah, this is a 5-5, five so, five, so it'll trade yeah, with the 6-4. So, four. voice of many's gone. What are the bigger ones that aren't the tokens? Uh, voice of many and Harald, King of Skemfart. Oh, he's got many, so you can't, you can't block that one. So okay, so I'll, yeah, just that one then. Um, yeah, yep. and then I'll take 16, 22. Two things are dying though, so everyone's losing two life. Everybody will lose two life. Yeah, from your and archer. an elf I control dies, so you guys will. Uh, I will also gain a life. When this leaves the battlefield, target opponent loses life equal to its power. So you, uh, Olivia, you're gonna lose five then yep. from this dying. No problem. Ugh. Okay. Ow. Jesus, I'm on 10. Okay. Gentlemen, uh, as you take your turns, I will say... It's me. I am easy to Hi. kill now. <laughs> I'm the problem. It's mm -hmm. that I, I can kill yeah. the problem. I can, I can deal with the problem. So don't kill but, me for one turn. Okay. Mm -hmm. But check this out. It's yeah. funnier if you just ax her. Because she thinks that she can solve things. and But if she does, nothing's keeping her in check anymore. Uh, no, I will probably die to all She's of your fibbing. things dying. I'm She's not fibbing. I, I can give you guys a chance against Olivia. Just don't kill me or kill me. It's up to you. Whatever you want to do. Mm, this is the fine. bargaining phase. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm not at acceptance yet, so. <laughs> I've done enough. If you guys, if you guys want to just ask me, I totally get it. It's chill. Like I said, winning's for losers. I never care if I lose. Again. Not enough. <laughs> yeah, so I love that. Strong. I love that. <laughs> Man, I feel like I haven't even gotten anything going yet, uh, uh -huh. so draw. So here's the deal. Necrons can be kind of a slow grind. Okay. Like, this deck is particularly explosive. Like, okay. I had two things in hand that were basically like, do you have an elf? You should have more. No, so I have a question. Can I play, like, how many cards can I play in a turn? I you can play as many that. cards as, many as you can pay as for. As you want. Okay. Yep. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's an hour and a half in. Hey, uh, how does hey, playing the cards work? Bro, it's your first uh, right, game. So We're swamp. not going to cover. There's no way we can cover everything. Don't Everyone worry. is so nice. <laughs> They're like, don't even self-deprecating humor about this. <laughs> well, because it. like magic's, magic's a really complicated game. Mm. Like it's really actually pretty hard. <laughs> so like, there's no reason to make the uh, already high level for entry any worse by being a jackass. I, got you. I, got I you. like you more and okay. more. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah, we should. This is amazing. So now I need six. So I will tap everything. Get out of here. You're all, you've been tapped. Uh, mm -hmm. And then I will play this Tomb Blade, right? Which we talked about earlier. So it's whenever Tomb Blade deals combat damage to a player, that player loses life equal to the number of creatures they control unless they sacrifice a creature. Oh, okay. Um, Gross. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. but yeah, but I can't, I can't use them right now. Cool. So now I can crew this sure with can. the tomb blade. Okay. Yep. So I got all uh -huh. these that I'm working with. Wow. So if I have look, at that has... his, look at him learning to tap the to crew the with the creature that just came out, so you can make everything useful. <laughs> <laughs> um, Love this. Is this considered an artifact? Oh, it is. It's an artifact it is. creature. Yeah. Oh, hey, look at wow. Okay, that's complicated. I feel like I had could do something here, but I don't know what. <laughs> You have so many elves. Like I feel like I doing anything yeah. but killing Arguably all of your elves many. at the same time is like I have not actually play. rabbits that look like elves. Yeah. <laughs> um Oh, Hi, look at the little you one. Ah. Uh, so let's see. A uh, little person. So and if I what if if I kill you any of your elves if I kill any of your elves, what happens, right? I take damage you... equal to their life or something. So if one of okay. my elves dies, everybody at the table except for me takes two damage and I will gain a life. So rude. I know, That's, I've so really I feel set like up a, a machine here. I feel like attacking you is a mistake. It's not then... the best ploy. Yeah. I, right now, direct attacks are bad news for me. Splash damage is probably how you'd get me. <laughs> or like so... things like art or enchantment removal because that gets rid of this stuff that starts giving me benefits or okay. targeted creature removal. So say you could get rid of the reach death toucher and then I have mm -hmm. nothing to block in the sky. 
that's the kind of stuff that's where the strategy starts showing up of like, ooh, maybe I can't attack into this person. But if I have removal for something that makes them harder to attack into or gains them a benefit outside of that, you okay. want to start using it that way. Cool. So I'm going to attack you with the the Scorpeth Destroyer. Okay. It's a 4-2. So it's probably going to die. It is going to die. And I'm <laughs> going to do it with one of these elves. Oh, yeah. Because you ha Ah, oh, they're all so strong. That's fine. I need so stuff in the graveyard. So it's That's a, fine. It's fine. So how, yes. what, what was the power toughness of your guy that uh, you're strong at? Four two. They will both die. All y'all will take two. I will gain one. And then I will send Zareth and Ghostark at Tim. But I will do Zareth first because then I get to mill three cards. Both will attack at the same time, but you're going to okay. resolve that attacking trigger before anything else happens. Right. Okay. Sounds. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. you got All it. right. No, you're and then doing great. Is you're doing card, really well here. Character. Please don't, please don't feel like we're giving you kid gloves. Like this is oh no, I, stuff. How many creatures died? Just one so far. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, I just didn't get anything. So great. <laughs> oh no, I'm sorry. Yeah, YouTube is right. Two creatures died. His creature that it technically hasn't happened yet. He's still doing attacks. Yeah. So I milled those cards. I don't have so anything. I'll just I can keep, keep this up. That one of these elves is going to die. And they are all <laughs> flying, so I can't block. So that's okay. what six damage. Yes. Is that the end of your turn? Yeah, that's it. That's all I got. Untap. I hope I'm not explaining too heavy for you either. <laughs> what? No, this is great. I love the okay. deluge of information. That's that's what I mean. I don't want to do the, do the flood where you're not going to remember any of this. So I hear, let me be extra helpful. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a quick learner. No, it's good. It's good. This is great. I'm going to tap all eight and I'm Ooh. going to play Dark Steel Monolith. Ooh. Uh, so it's indestructible. It, it's indestructible, and then once each turn, you may pay zero rather than pay the mana cost for a colorless spell you cast from your hand. So I will now cast. What? Wait, 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 wait! It's whoa, got whoa, whoa, cascade what? on your commander. Yes. It's a eight you cascade mana. first. What's wrong? Your commander. Your commander has cascade, cascade for correct. playing something greater than seven. Yes. So you just played something greater than seven. That's the cascades correct. are now happening. Do you want me to do the cascade first? Yes. It will happen oh. first. Yes. Oh, it does apologize. happen first. I apologize. Yeah. Yeah, so your okay. spell no, will be good. on the stack before it hits the board even. You'll resolve your cascade. And then it's going to be um anything that is uh, seven seven or under. Do right, you guys want to see, see do you guys want to see as I'm Yeah. Yes. Oh. What'd you get? What'd you get? Uh that was a that was a ten. Oh. Okay, glad we missed that one. Uh, so this first one is Geode mm -hmm. Golem. Oh, uh -huh. okay. Does have trample on it, and then yes. whenever Geode Golem deals combat damage to a player, you may cast your commander from the command zone without paying the mana cost. But he's already out, so. Ew, yep. Uh, so that's my first cascade, and Correct. then here comes my second. Ooh, nice. More mana. Yeah. So um, that'll be it. Uh, it's a non-land card, not a yep. creature. So yeah. So we're uh, good with that, yeah. Will, yeah. So that's beautiful. That and then uh, these these that. are going to go back to the bottom of my library, correct? They don't go into my. Yeah, they go into they don't the bottom go, of my library. Yeah. Okay, cool. I would like to do the dark steel monolith. Yes, dark steel's down, so you can resolve that now. Yeah, and then we're gonna play it that betrays. Uh, with Annihilator <laughs> 2. Whenever creature attacks, defending player sacrifices two permanents, and whenever an opponent sacrifices a non-token permanent, put that card onto the battlefield under my control. I mm. don't think I will, actually. <laughs> 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 it that betrays has yeah. entered the battlefield. Uh, what's the text on your commander? Uh, and it's then awesome. I get to, and then I get to cascade, cascade again. What does your dark steel say? It says you can cast it without paying its mana cost. Yeah, it says once once each turn you may pay zero rather than pay the mana, so that it, you That's get to cascade casting. again, right? Oh, so you cascade I... twice more. <laughs> That's very fun. <laughs> wow! Oh yeah. When they see the synergy, that yeah. cackle comes out. What? I'm going for eleven. So flare oh. of loyalties gets to come out. This is. <laughs> Uh, when you cast a spell, gain control of target creature until the end of turn. Untap that creature. I would rather you didn't. No. no, but I really want to. No. Um, when you cast a spell, gain control of a target creature until the end of turn. Untap that creature until the end of turn. It has base power and toughness 10-10 and gains trample, <laughs> annihilator 2, and haste. Oh my. <laughs> and you'll do that before your next cascade. So you need to pick a target. Oh, man. <laughs> 
<laughs> this is the hard part. This is the hard part trying to look at everybody's cards and figure out what I actually so, want to okay. play around so, with. So I'm gonna take. Let's see. I, I think I'm gonna want. I'm gonna want to take one of Bromance because it's got flying on it. Also a good choice. What are you doing? Uh, I think I'm gonna take control of your commander for a turn. What? And I'm gonna give him 10-10 <laughs> flying with. Um, oh. Here he has flying. Sorry, it's gonna be 10-10 with trample, annihilator two, and haste. Oh, oh what? I so, wish I so could tap Black now, Girl right now. <laughs> now that it's under your control, how do I change it on my board? Just you put don't. it up to it, the top. He's, he's just, just like move it off to the side yeah. or something. You're gonna get it back at the okay. end of this turn unless it dies. Unless it dies. Oh, it, mm, it's probably it's gonna, gonna die. die. Wait, oh, does yeah, that 100%. mean? Wait, is he? You're gonna, you can do stuff with it. Yeah, yes? yeah, it's my it's now. Yeah, it's, yeah. It has, it has <laughs> haste. It has, it also, it also has all of the attributes that it, that is on the commander oh. card, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yep. so it's got flying. And then it is an exact copy of that card plus. If we were sitting at a table, you would take that card from his yeah. and put it on yours. It is so, exactly as it reads. So you've stolen that, but we still have another cascade to resolve. Yep. There it is. Yep, there cool. we go. So Hedron, uh, Hedron Archive. I get to, I get two extra mana. That was really good having yep. Thrawn Dynamo an and excellent. Hedron Archive coming out. That's really yes. sick. That was a really good this play. Ridiculous. Wow. I'm very happy with that one. Tim doesn't need my help. <laughs> okay. No, he doesn't. I'm, but I, I am. So more we're than both happy about to, to die, them, right? Though. Like we're about to die. It depends. Yeah, okay. It depends. Okay, is Tim right, is a okay. merciful god or not? So Tim went bleh onto his board. Yeah, I finally got all to do well. what, what this deck is designed to do, which is sick. Good job. And then I also got Ben's card, uh, which yeah, I will. Yeah, you still. Yeah, but it. it's oh, oh, just for ben, one. Ben, we're turn. so sorry. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm intimidated. Got its own trigger. Get it. Intimidated. That's good, dude. <laughs> You're welcome, chat. Are right, we good? I think we're good, Liv. If we're wrong, it's an engagement play. There you go. I love it. I'm All bringing right. some confrontation to the comments. There you go. Perfect. <laughs> All right. uh, ben, I'm going to take your commander and I'm going to throw it at Olivia with fly. It has flying. It has haste. It has annihilator two and wow. and trample. Uh, so you're sending the commander at me. Correct. I am sending Ben's commander at you. You also have uh, a mill Ben. I'm sorry. Oh, and then I have to. What? And then I get yeah, to. Yeah, you've mill. got a mill. You mill on the attack. Yep. And that's just. I I'm will... just pulling the three, and I'm going to lay them out. Great. So then the only valid target is the boots. It just goes in my hand. Got yeah, it. Yeah, into your yeah. hand. And the other two are in the bin. All right. So with that done, I'm going to annihilate two of the elf tokens. Uh, you got death triggers. Yes, your I do. I might two. die here. Yeah, you might actually. And that's just oh, from no. slash damage. I apologize. It's okay. Yeah, it is going to be from slash damage. I just really wanted to get some of her damage. stuff off the field. Fair. <laughs> um, okay, so I've got the Lathril and the Elder Fang Venom triggers. Two of my elves are dying. I will gain two. We take two? Yes. Did you also, did you, or, or were, no, you, were you able four, to block all the damage? Oh, no, from it's because there's this too, not, not this. We haven't got no. to the blocks yet. We're not oh, getting okay, to cool. the, we're not at the block yet. I'm just doing got the it. elves from the annihilator. So, yeah, whenever another creature dies, each opponent loses a life, two elves. Whenever an elf dies, that's two more, and then I will gain two. So, it yeah. should be four to everybody, Ugh, two to me. Three. Crap. You're not dead. Not yet. She will be. She will you know? be. I don't I'm think she's to gonna die. make. I don't think she's gonna make it through the turn because I'm gonna block here. So I'm going to block the commander. I'm sorry, buddy. We'll just be dead together the whole time. It'll be. It'll, it'll just be That's, hanging out dead. Yeah. I, oh, yeah. No. Um. Okay. So I'm gonna <laughs> block with poison tip archer. It does have reach, so I can block the flyer. It also has death touch, so that will kill it as well. Oh, just real quick. Um, because Ulamog was in there, he went into the graveyard. I get to shuffle shuffle my, it back in everything yeah, back yeah. my entire graveyard back into my yes my library. Yeah. So. It's, it's got nice five chat. butts. Oh, right. It's, it's, it is six. No, it's six bites. Yeah, it's four ten butt. ten with trample and butt. flying. It takes six. Okay, cool. <laughs> um, an elf died, but the other one doesn't. Well, yeah, it will see both. It will see both. Okay. And then another round of dunks from two creatures dying. One of them is an elf. So another four from two creatures. One, two, three, four. And then I gain one. Okay, I'm dead. Oh, it's actually, you're actually Xaxes. Yeah, it's, you're still yeah. dead, but it's only three. Super four. dead, yeah. Well, Ben, oh I was God. gonna try and help you out and clear the board, but uh, yeah, good luck. <laughs> I, I was gonna, I was gonna let you do that. I was gonna. Yeah. I, sh Sorry. I should have done more. Go. I should have done better math. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> math will kill us all. Eventually. Math always gets us in the end. But on the plus side, you got rid of the poison tip archer, which is you did, the thing which that's is a, a lot problem. Of good grief. All right, so then uh, Ben, your commander is dead, so it's going to go back to the command zone, Sorry. and you'll have to pay two more to cast it. 
next time. Gotcha. Okay. What else you got, Tim? Got so much mana left. Yeah, I do have. <laughs> I do have mana left. That uh, was just the start. There's more. <laughs> Tim can do more. That was so much. Tim was just doing the oh, most. Oh, hold on. Kevin, uh, someone may be right. Ailey, you may have one life. Why? Because this doesn't trigger for itself. It's whenever another, whenever another creature, creature dies. dies. I think. Oh, you need to fucking shuffle that. Oh. I remember uh, it was in my hand. Okay. She's at one. Am I alive at one? You're alive at one. Because oh. I only hit you for. It only was two damage to everybody that last time. Because it's. All right. Well, I remember the important things in my hands. And then. So yeah. I'll, I'll get it. yeah. And then you you counted that the five as commander damage, right? Yeah. <laughs> Hang on. I'm just reviving myself. I will tap. These two for Cryptic Gateway. What's that one? Uh, tap two, it's an artifact. Tap two untapped creatures you control. You may put a creature card from your hand into play that shares a creature type with each creature tapped this way. Bleh. And that oh. will be the end of my turn. Oof. This is great. <laughs> I can't wait to be dead. <laughs> it's gonna be I'm very gonna, same. Same. Yeah, big same. I'm gonna try to help out. <laughs> 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 oh, smoked. I'm just happy I get to do stuff. I never get this far I love my when deck. We love getting to do stuff. Yeah, that's my favorite. Yeah, I usually get that's shut why down I don't, real quick. That's why I don't care if if, if I lose. I, I just want people to do things. It's my turn. I'm alive. Unfortunately, one. yes. Yes. <laughs> Thanks, Red. Oh, and I hey, have no food problem, too. buddy. Let's see if I can survive and help solve problems. So, Scour Barons is going to enter tapped. I will gain two life because Bilbo is out. Anything in my bin that can Chris, deal when with Lupo that doesn't shot. dumpster you in three turns, you get to play. I mean, that's the fun way to do it. I was going to ask three turns Tim, is like meh. Mm -hmm. I was going to ask, do you not get to use this deck because everyone decides to kill you before you yeah, get started? Lupo, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. Lupo if you know what's up, it's terrifying. Yeah, 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 exactly. Oh, a land enters the battlefield. I'm going to make a treasure. I'm going to use that treasure to sacrifice the food. I'm going to gain four life. I'm still probably dead here, but whatever. Going out, swinging. It's the only way to go. Yeah. Olivia, what's the least power on your board? A four, two. Ben, what's the least power on yours? Don't three, three. for this. Three. And Tim, what's the least power on yours? It is a five, three. She just wants power for a card yeah. that's going to matter based on power. Yeah. Okay. So all of my guys are buffed, so they're going to get dead regardless but you know what i want ben to have a fighting chance here so wow i'm at seven i'm gonna pay mm. five and i am going to destroy all creatures with power greater than ben's three power creature so oh. anything else so anything above three power is gone anything above three power is gonna go die die <laughs> why because whenever another elf i control dies one, How two, many of these little assholes do you have? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, sixteen. Oh no, not everybody uh, dies. I'm gonna play... I'll take out two, two of y'all. And then just, I will be able, I'll be able to play Warping Wall as my instant for your turn, and I can counter target sorcery spell. <gasps> okay. So it, I will so, kill you and and Tim if you cast if that resolves. You guys yeah, both so die that's, just from that's this. A, that's a good play then. Tim will save his life, and uh, I will probably die to Olivia now, which is definitely that's fine, gonna so. that would stop you from killing all my stuff, right? Correct. Yes, yes. and it okay. stops you. It, it keeps you both in the game. It does. <laughs> okay, cool. So uh, it is our stuff, but Tim gets to keep his no. stuff. No, 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 no. It got uh, everybody okay. keeps everybody keeps everything. Um, I'll move to the end step then and welcome my death. Uh, this will go up to four. Uh, yeah, that's all I can do. <laughs> Good luck, Ben. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> so, what just happened? <laughs> okay. So I so am confused. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I attempted to kill absolutely everything on the board, barring okay. your three power creature, because okay. that was the smallest thing. So I wanted to try and get all of Olivia's board clear and mm -hmm. uh, Tim's board because they're okay. way too many. They're big very dumbs. strong. Yeah. Very whoa, strong. Whoa, whoa, yeah. whoa, whoa! Oh, they have uh, some IQ. All right. Tim decided no. So none of that happened. Oh, he countered the spell for everybody, not just yes. him. Yeah, I stopped so, her spell. The spell affected everybody. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. What? I worked so hard to get these guys out here. Why would you do this to me? To because me specifically. If, if her spell had resolved, it would just be you and me. Yeah, she yeah. would have. My right, effect would have killed the two of them. Two of them. I, that way. 
Yeah. yeah. And you were okay fine. with that. You would have been like, yeah, okay. You know, yeah, okay I would have I would have handled it. This now just becomes 11. Everybody can tap and is active. Yeehaw. Tim, buddy, old pal that I've known for yeah, a couple two hours and now. A, two and a half hours. Yeah. Yeah, it's been great. Um, it has been. Yeah, it's been really delightful. None of those large friends have the word reach on them. Right? No, they can't stop flying things from hitting me. Okay. Neat. I'm just curious. I will try to get myself as close as possible. I am going to, in the interest of everyone and their time and enjoyment of this, going to open the gates, as it were, and just progress the board state, both mine and everybody else's, to the point where I will be gettable. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to cast a Wirewood Channeler. It is, I can tap it to add X of any, X mana of any one color, where X is the number of elves on the battlefield, which is a lot, but it has summoning sickness, so that can't happen. So the one black, two more here for an Elder Fang Ritualist. When it dies, I can return an elf card from the yard to my hand. I am now hellbent. I have no cards in hand. So this is what you see is what you get. So I will tap 10 of my elf tokens. Oh boy. I will have one elf token that is allowed to remain standing. <laughs> I will tap Lathril. Y'all will lose 10, I'll gain 10. This is like, how can you do this to another person? This is so, how would they make a video? How would they make a game Didn't where this is possible? Didn't you ask me to step on you earlier? <laughs> no. Well, that was a joke. That was she's, no, she's, but she's doing it. Yeah, she's really <laughs> stepping on me. Now all of a sudden reference. things are changed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I didn't mean for you to actually step on me. Yeah, this is, it was a joke. <laughs> we were just joshing. All right. Just, this is where you find out she had a around. knife in the stilettos yeah. and extended out. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, Ben, you did say that. I did say it. I did. It's on just, me. I'm just following through. <laughs> um, <laughs> I feel like it's unfair to Ben to just take him out like this. I only have 10 health. I know. And I have a, I have a 17, 17 jacket scar archers. <laughs> Let's just see if I can close it out. Someone might have schemes. Tim, I will swing a 1717 Jagged Scar Archers at Ben, which is enough to eliminate his life total. Last I checked, <laughs> I again am bad at math. Yeah, and then that's good. swinging for the fences here, I will swing a 6 3 Herald King of Skemfar that has menace. It must be blocked by two creatures, or oh. it will not be blocked. Mm. Uh, a five, uh, 4 2 Elf, a five, three elf, and a four, two elf. But Olivia. So, yes. What if you gave Ben one more turn just to see what he can do, and then you kill him? Just one more turn. Oh, right. I'll leave the jagged scar up. <laughs> <sighs> Only because it's your first time. Yeah. All right. Next time okay, we don't everybody, yeah. everybody gets We're one. Everybody gets one. Everybody gets one. <laughs> you get one. Thanks, Batman. Um, so <laughs> Spider Man. <laughs> Spider Man joke. Six four is Spider Man. 10, Sorry, Internet. Uh is fifteen is nineteen damage coming at you, Tim. Six of it must be blocked by two creatures. I think you have exactly four things that can block. So. I do have four things that can block. Damn, that means Sorry. everything dies, doesn't it? Well, uh, yes. Actually, so attacking touch, right? attacking yes. elves all have death touch, so yes. So one is going to get through regardless. Correct. And it's uh, choose your own adventure on that. Two of them will kill you. Two of them will leave you at one. I think he's dead either way, just with I, I think, yeah, I think I'm just dead regardless. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because mm -hmm. if you kill my elves, then I'll get you for the last remaining one, one, yeah. one point. All right. Well, kill him you know anyway. What? Kill just, him anyway. Just and giggles. We'll block it all. Right. Okay. So, uh, pick which creature survives. Let the least power live. Okay. So we'll leave the token up, and the other three will go. Good luck. Have fun, Ben. Ah. Ben still takes damage though off of the elves diving. He does. Dying. Yeah. How much damage do I take? Three elves oh. are down. Oh boy. So that was really fun though. I got no hand, so whatever Stop happens, happens. All right. Go, Ben. Go. All right, so I got to do all the things. Everything's coming back. Okay. I believe in you, Ben. Okay, all right. Let me draw this card here. All right, let me see what we can do here. So have that is going to, that's going to be special. Okay. <laughs> I just want to say to everybody yeah. here really quick, both stream chats have been absolutely delightful. And thank you for uh, having awesome communities that aren't. Yeah. 
No, you guys have been awesome. Way- we work very to, hard compared for that. to the sweaties that I play against all the time. <laughs> this has been so nice. Oh, good. <laughs> it's been so okay, lovely. so so I am going. I'm I'm not sure how this is going to work out, but I'm going to believe in the future. So I am going to tap five here. Okay, and then I'm going to use that because we're going to believe in the future, and we're going to summon this spider here. Yeah. Uh, and the spider's going to hang out. I'm believing in the future. All right. I'm I'm believing that somehow, maybe the kids will be all right. <laughs> Who knows? I'm believing that somehow we're gonna make it through this. Um, okay, and then do you have any flying creatures? I do not. Or any anything and I that's don't flying? have anything that can block flyers. I'm actually uh completely vulnerable to flyers. Yes. Okay, so that's great. So I'm going to attack with the Tomb Blade here. Uh you got and it. it says whenever Tomb Blade deals combat damage to a player, that player loses life equal to the number of creatures they control unless they sacrifice yes. a creature. Don't sacrifice anything, Olivia. You know what? I I, <laughs> I will take it on the chin. I yes. will lose one. Ah, oh, it's 13, 14, 15. <laughs> I will lose 16 life. I will not. I will not okay. sacrifice a I will be wow. greedy. Wow. Okay. Well, all right then, I guess. Uh, <laughs> We're having <that's>... fun here. <laughs> uh, and then, well, I can, I can probably this right oh look he reminded yeah. remember to attack yeah, yeah you I sure could, can i can crew that, that and then attack with that yeah okay so hang on are you so oh you brought the canoptic spider at this turn yes you can attack yes. with both totally yeah all right so all right. then and then if the other one three, is flying three. it's just three okay three three yeah and you attacked I, with the other guy too make sure you tap correct that so so tap they, that right oh now. yeah tap every this guy. all your creatures should there be tapped including the car right, there we go you got it you did a dent do you embrace the sweet embrace of death are you You'd ready? think I no. Go ahead. You can try it. <laughs> <laughs> Something might oh, happen. Oh, <laughs> look at him leaving a man up and talking some. <laughs> huh? I can try. I got one you know, move. I think I just might. I think I just okay. might try. Yeah. I'll untap okay. and I'll draw a card. Okay. Maybe I will try. Go Ben. I think I, think I understand I, how this I'm card trying works. To, so. I'm trying to rack my brains over what one black. Instant take mm. no damage fog there is. I don't know. <laughs> it it okay. kind of reminds me of Tim, honestly. I'm I sorry? don't know. <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sorry, someone in chat doom. Did you I don't know if you saw this, but it's so good. And I know it's not the right accent, but that's okay. I love the British magic god that hops in to make rulings or check on things. <laughs> 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 oh, <this>. Amazing. <laughs> I'm going to play one of the most powerful cards in Magic, which is a basic land. Oh, okay. <laughs> and then I am going to try and full swing at Ben. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to tap this card and yes. I'm going to cast uh, Darkness, which prevents all you combat did! damage that would be dealt in this turn. <laughs> Good job. Hell hey. yes. Hell yes. <laughs> Very I believe, nice. I believe all in the damage future. is prevented. Look at you hanging out. Let's go, Ben. Man. I thought that was, I got that in the beginning. I was like, this feels like really strong. You uh, are correct. A fog good. is very strong in situations <laughs> such as this. I have no further actions I can take. Okay. I'll pass the turn. Okay. Yes, everybody, I know I could have last rolled, but we're letting our friend have a good Oh, one, okay? well, if you could have, wait, how? You could have attacked me through that still? No, I could have killed you before attacks. Oh, You're at seven health, oh. and I could have tapped down ten elves and hit Lathro. Okay. I know but that's no fun. I know, but that doesn't count as combat damage. No. I want. I really want to learn. Oh, okay, so that would be out of combat. Right, that's damage. different. That is loss. It specifically calls this out as loss of life as well. So uh, this would okay. not be prevented by darkness. Damn. Okay. Well, then I wouldn't have been talking if I could read that card. <laughs> All right. So I'm gonna draw a card. See, friends, we're here to help people learn. Like, I don't need yeah. a W. I've played Commander for way too long. All right. It's way cooler to have someone <laughs> new come in, like learn things, land. and have a good time so they want to keep playing so there's more people to play Magic and be friends Friendly. with. That's that's the one good of that's awesome. one, okay. one of us. So I have, <laughs> the, so I guess I have two, two of those. Can you only play one land on a turn? Or yes, yes. unless you have unless cards that tell you otherwise. Got it. Yeah. yeah, unless it's like, hey, add a land when you unless land. Unless you're playing green. <laughs> yeah, unless uh. you're playing green. There will be things that they just put an extra land out. Play more than one land a turn. Jeez. There are a, There's a bunch of green cards you could run. You could probably get like, I don't know, at minimum five or six lands per turn. 
before more shenanigans ensue. So yeah, it's it's fun to start getting really cutthroat once everybody's on a level playing field and you're all playing big, big DJ and stuff and you've really established a pod where it's like, I know I'm going to talk with this person and we're going to jab at each other and just be big and be completely fine at the end of the game because we understand each other and have a good social dynamic. Yeah. Like it can feel when someone's coming in new and everyone's like, well, I'm not going to hold back because they're a new player. They got to learn and then just dunks on someone without like <laughs> casual helping formats. them. Yeah. Oh, because yeah. that's a feel bad where you're like, we know some people I'm like that. I want to play this again if my yeah. friends are just on me and I can't learn. That feels bad. So why do that? That's you know, right. later when they know what they're doing and you can dunk on them anyway. Yeah. That's the fun stuff. I still want to clown on people. All right, Ben, dazzle us, friend. I, I um, got no razzle and no dazzle, boss. <laughs> no, all <laughs> razzle, no dazzle. <laughs> I'm, think, I'm thinking it through. <laughs> yeah, it's not good. It's not good there, boss. <laughs> Man, this is really, this, I'm really uh <laughs> i mean kind of but we're here to help yeah we're here yeah. to try no 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 so i i don't <laughs> we're gonna make it as gentle as possible all right <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna crush you but like, like a squish mellow uh yeah <laughs> just, just a gentle yeah. squeeze <laughs> all right just a quick, um, okay so i need six for this so i'm gonna tap six uh, and then I'm going to summon my Hexmark Defender. It's an artifact creature, multi-threat eliminator. Hexmark Destroyer can't be blocked except by six or more creatures. Cool. Ooh. Oh. So, I yeah. mean, I can, but yikes. <laughs> yeah, so, uh-huh. Oh, and my then, God. So whenever a non-token artifact creature or vehicle enters the battlefield under your control, draw a card. Okay, so I got a card. A good spooder. Man, I wish I had more mana. Okay. Uh, yeah, the eternal story. Yeah, right. It's okay. The flood or the screw. It's one or the other. Cool. All right. So this this is where I'm at. <clears throat> so I'm I'm shields down. Yeah. So you oh. can swing at her and. Okay. Well then, I'll just send it all. <laughs> yeah. Let's. There it is. We're gonna alpha strike it out. Let's do this. All right. So uh, so the hexmark destroyer is a six six and can that only be blocked. That just came in this uh, cone attack. Oh, that's yeah. That's yeah. he's. Yeah. Yeah. You can, it, but you can crew. crew. You can crew it. You can crew. It can crew. All right. So we'll crew uh the ghost arc with the giant death yep. machine. There you um, go. We'll attack with that. That's three three, and then uh, the Sanapex Spider, which is a four four, mm -hmm. and then Tomb Blade, which is a five four. So well, and, and all does those, what? And and uh, it's a five four, and it will do uh, damage equal to the life yes. that, uh, uh, according to the number players control, unless they <laughs> sacrifice a creature. You know what? You think you'll sacrifice a creature this time? <laughs> You can have it. <laughs> what? Oh, oh please. Do you want do you want the win with it? how's this? If I can if I can make you rue it. Make me what? Rue? If I can make you rue the day. If I can just absolutely dunk on you with this, which is the next top card I have. Okay. <laughs> sure. She's a swamp. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll just GGs. send it. GG. I'm, no, I... I'm not sacrificing my elves. No, we band together. I don't kill my people. <laughs> Yeah, it's a RP yeah. elf commander. I win! Yay! Yeah. 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 Wow, I did that. It was all Yay. me. No help, too. Not a single no help, help at all. Yeah. Oh, wow. GG's in the right chat right for Commander. Roman. Look at you go. Wow. And wow, now he's thanks. fully addicted. Yeah. Oh, my. Very. What a win. Oh, my God. Wow, that was Good nuts. Job. <laughs> I was really proud of myself for the darkness. Uh, yeah, that, that, was, that was really good. That was dude. so good. And Great just player. sitting and waiting until it yeah. actually was going to have a huge impact. Absolutely. Mattered, yeah. Oh, yeah. Genius. First draw. Look Genius. at that big brain play. Someone's just going to be like, oh, yeah, swing out and kill you. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. But wait. Plus, no. plus, I hate, like, sweaty gamers in chat and I may know. But uh, <laughs> very few people remember that there is a one black fog. Yeah. Ah. Unless they they have like a very deep remembrance of very old magic cards or they love the Necron Dynasties deck and know that it's in there. Like oh, wow. it is not a commonly seen nor run card. Um, oh, wow. Which of course, cool. friends, you can always fix because it's very good. Yeah. So like 
yeah, that was undefeated. Huge, I, I genuinely was undefeated. just like, I know darkness exists. I know it's in there. I was just like, he does have an instant. Ah, let's see. And you just, you <laughs> just let's call first. his bluff. Congrats. <laughs> Uh, no yeah. bluff. Yay! As long as you guys had fun. That's the most amazing yeah, thing. Class. Okay, good. This was the coolest yeah. thing ever. And I, I feel like, uh, yeah, I didn't just have a great time. I learned a lot. And, and yeah, thanks for making something that could have been super intimidating, like the most approachable thing ever. Like, Yay. for oh, real. good. That's Our all pleasure. that yeah. yeah. Probably, Honestly, yeah. The, yeah. More, the more people we can play Magic with, the better, right? So, like, there's no reason to be dicks about people trying to come into it. Like, it's... Exactly. There's so many rules. There are so many things. Someone in uh, uh, Darkness's chat was absolutely like, like, when you've played for a long time and you're playing with someone new and you're just going full throttle, it can absolutely feel like you're just making <laughs> up out of the yeah. blue. Yeah. To of like, course, yeah. like it's when you're playing Calvin Ball at six years old. It's like, yeah, well, but the rule is, if you touch me, it's actually not tag. Like, it feels super weird, right? <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. better to maybe have a couple of like kid glove games where yeah. they can show you. Here's yeah. if we were playing for real. Here's how I would annihilate you, <laughs> because then you get to learn the strategy. You know what to look for for things. You can see it coming, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Like. It's good to feel good playing the game, and then you can get more into it, and then start yeah. being cutthroat with your friends once you're at that level, and then I it's mean, fun. If I had had a bad first experience with Commander, I probably wouldn't be in Magic or doing any of the things I do. So you know, shout out wow. to the person who told me how to play. That's Commander awesome. Was patient. My though, so. my very first game of Commander was an eight person two headed giant game of Commander. Whoa! <laughs> so each, each one of us was a pair of people working together, which is both entirely too much but at the same time it was really nice i have one of my friends sitting here teaching me like hey here's why yeah. we play a land right here here's why we maybe shouldn't attack this person or like kind of explaining me to me and walking through so yeah it was a mess but i had someone very helpfully walking me through the steps so it all made sense so once i did take the training wheels up i was like oh i get why this didn't work or maybe here's how i can like better play it out next time but everything sequencing wise made sense and it was really easy to kind of like go from there yeah so well thanks for having us today yeah. guys. dude thanks yeah, for having thanks us, for having us. Yeah. i'm gonna resonate my chat but anytime you guys want to play magic i'm totally down because this I'm was super, yeah. i love playing awesome magic experience. i do yes. it all the time i will continue to do it all the time if you ever need a fourth or just want to hang or like make a pod like hit yeah. me up i'm Sick. i'm always down cool awesome yeah Elder Dragon Hijinx is proudly sponsored by Face to Face Games. If you're looking for the latest sets or sought after singles, check out facetofacegames.com and use the code Hijinx for 5% off your order. Looking for the best accessories for your decks? Look no further than Game Genic. They have everything you could possibly need to protect and store your cards and so much more. Use our code Hijinx on Cool Stuff Inc. or Face to Face Games to get 5% off your purchase. Ailey and I want to say thanks so much to our patrons. We really appreciate your support in helping make Elder Dragon hijinks a thing that will continue for as long as we can play casual, ridiculous commander. Thanks again, patrons.